This is Wanna Bindi, and in this video tutorial for Game Maker Studio, I'll show you something like this. So basically, you have your little tank, it can shoot, and once, for example, a shot hits this little well box, you get um, well the box is gonna get destroyed itself, and then you get a new weapon. So basically, this is just weapon swap, and you just get big huge green ball to fire off so how does this work um well this is quite easy to do this is one of indie i am the developer of the game clunky swords and a programmer slash pixel artist so if you're new here and you want more consider subscribing to my channel because i upload every two days a video so well basically what we have here are a few things. First of all, my little tank, and once I press a button, it just shoots an instance or an object, which is just this little O bullet tank. And I swapped it with a variable because, um, well, I wanted to assign it first of all to the object we're gonna spawn. And for example, once uh, we pick up this object here, which you saw on the screen, which is just a random thing then we're gonna swap this variable for, let's say for example with the bullet tool which was the green one and so you can just dynamically pick up some stuff and you get a new weapon which you're shooting so this is one and easy way to do it so let's get right into it first of all we have our weapon box and that has only well the image speed set to zero because why why, why is that zero because um if we would be doing that we play then it opens i want it to be all the time closed but once for example there's a collision with come on uh, with one of those bullets or we can just drive over with our tank but i just did it on the bullet collision we just say all right start the image speed and once the image speed well is set to one it just runs its animations and once it hits its last animation it just then says animation end you want it to be destroyed so basically we have a zero then we have a collision then we say all right are we hitting the last animation oh the image last image index and then bam we destroy it and once we destroy it we have one last thing which is the destroy thing and then we just basically create on our instances so basically one of those layers our weapon which is this one on the same position so and then we just assign it to a variable and then with a the variable we just say all right i want a specific image index and that is going to get chosen randomly that's why i say random range between zero and five why zero and five because once we go into our thingy it only has five images so basically it can be one of those here and for example if you go in here and the tank we have a t the collision with the tank it just well once it touches this little thing it just all right destroy it but you can do a little effect here as well or a sound that you picked it up and then depending on on its image index you say all right change the weapon which uh, the tank is shooting so basically the O tank which is our player and the weapon and then assign it to the specific well bullet you want to change and I just have those two here the standard one and then the big green one and that is basically it. but for example you would put in a few different ones well and this is how it works quite easy to copy and well there is no big magic here have a good one one up indie